dude, that guy is totally, totally not safe. Look at that. <laughs> Look at that hood. He can barely even see out of it. You know what this reminds me of? I thought it was being towed for a second, but it was just, he's just driving it. <laughs> I, I gotta, I gotta, I gotta see this. <laughs> Hey guys, we are on our way to look at an estate of records. Not sure the state that they're going to be in. No pun at intended. The at the estate. <laughs> However, if it's a house of wax, like the last one, we're excited. We're excited. Don't really know a whole lot about it. Actually, he said if we uh, if we make a deal, we're going to need a U-Haul. A lot of records. So that sounds like a lot of records. I'm hoping it's not all like junk you know like polka oh, or something man. or lots of gospel know, no offense burr wives i know some gospels Engelbert, good according Humperdink. to a lot of you yeah. yeah that would be kind of unfortunate but we're hoping Conway that titty. Yeah, <laughs> we're hoping that we find uh some good stuff that we just don't see much yeah. uh it's actually kind of outside of baltimore maryland so we're hoping that the music you know is a little bit different than what we find up in virginia um, in West Virginia. In West Virginia. My God, we see so much Hank Williams, Merle yeah. Haggard, Waylon Jennings, which is fine, but we're quite sick of that because we see that stuff all the time. Yeah, so we're maybe hoping to find some good like jazz, some maybe R&B stuff, soul, anything like that. Blues would be amazing. Heavy metal, punk music. Um, you guys know all the good stuff. It, it's been a while since we've gotten like a really nice like jazz collection or something. So hoping we find some stuff like that. Yeah. I think that would be pretty cool. But uh, I brought my GoPro today. I'm going to wear a GoPro. Danny's holding this other camera here. We can we'll take you to, along. Yeah, we'll take you guys along. We'll try you can to capture dig with us. the whole moment. Yeah. Um, should be pretty fun, guys. Yeah. And uh, if you like the channel, please like and subscribe. We saw last night that 70% of our viewers are not subscribed. What's wrong with you guys? Yeah. <laughs> You'll watch our videos, but you won't follow along with us? Follow along. How will you know when you're going to see awesome content like what you're seeing right now? Right. This is all uncut, unscripted. Uh, we don't know what we're going to get into today. So right. um, let's ride along. Let's yeah. go. You ready? Yeah. I'm ready. Let's go. Let's go. Because I've been, <laughs> I'll be honest with you. Siders, I mean, he's got them all sleeved up and everything. And okay. So. so he's probably got most of the better stuff inside well, if I had to take a guess. Well, so. I don't, I don't, you don't know. They, it's just they, all they scattered. Were, they were buying just 40, 50 years ago. Wow. I buy comic books too, if you've run across any of them. And then the old shirts, uh, pot posters, music memorabilia. I would be dealing all that kind of stuff. So, But records are a good thing. So we'll go through. All right. We'll start here, I guess, and then make our way into the house, man. And if you need anything, let me know. And if I need anything, I'll holler at you. <laughs> Appreciate it, buddy. Thank you. Hey. That's the ceiling. Good sign, maybe. Some Sinatra right there. That'd be amazing. If I found some blue notes, I'd be freaking back up the van and say, let's go. <laughs> I got sleeves here. So somebody was like collecting or something at some point. You know, if they, if they took the time to sleeve some stuff, they might have some stuff that's, that's worth a damn. The only thing is, is if they move, like, did they take all the good stuff and just leave the junk behind? Or if they had passed away, they might have left all the good stuff, obviously. No one messed with it, so we'll check it out. Quadraphonic stuff here. There's Jones. Some popular hits. Then 77, so that's uh, he was buying from uh look, he's buying from Dennis at some point. At least a classical here. Stan Kenton. There you go. Stan Kenton's good. What else we got here? Looking like Paul Stan Kenton. I'm not. Capital Jazz, here we go. This back is, you gotta that box right Flip, flip, flip. Mm -hmm. oh, right here. There's some Stan Kenton. There's Stan a lot of Stan Kenton. This is all Stan Kenton. Yeah, I believe this is a whole box of Stan Kenton. 
Dude, this ain't bad. This ain't bad. Look at all this thing can. It's in fantastic shape. Fabulous shape. This is a whole box of Stan Kenton. Interesting, man. Can you imagine if they, like, we could find a box of like all Miles Davis or like all Coltrane? Dude. Dude. There might be. This is all Stan Kenton. Okay. Well, these are sleeved back here. I don't even know what we got here. Harbor Strazan. Me too. We're not in any short of time. It doesn't matter. We gotta take a look out here. Absolutely. Let's well, only take a second. First, because going off of what's out here, well, might we'll see what we got out here. First. Just trying to find that good stuff, y'all. Got no patience. Well, <laughs> not phase four. There's hun like hundreds of that phase four. Phase four stereo. Yeah. All right. I'm gonna set these here for the time being. What else we got? We got boxes back here, Danny. It's hard to see what's back here. There's boxes of stuff back here. What are these? These glasses. Man, he's gonna have a lifetime getting all this out. One box could change it all. I'm assuming these are records. Yeah, records, 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 records. Don't look like anybody's been in them either. Yeah. I feel like there's going to be some good stuff somewhere because look, they've taken the time to 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 bag these stereos. Look at this. Look at this. This looks beautiful. I mean, you know, I don't know if it works, obviously, but this looks beautiful. Another stereo there. Look at them, guys. They're all bagged up. Buy the house. It's Fisher speakers. Those aren't bad. It's not bad. It's on Verve. Yeah. Pretty clean piece. Very manalo. We finding gold? I think I just saw Linda Ronstadt in this one too. There's so much Linda Ronstadt in this world. Burt Camper. Captain Tennille. Yeah, Burt Camper. That's what I got over here. That's weird. Let's hope that all the great stuff inside. There's still a purse. We sell this one a good bit. A couple bucks, but Jackie Gleason. I've never seen this one. Lynn Ross, I've never seen that one. Johnny Mathis. Nope, 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 nope. Benny Goodman. Dick Hyman. Hyman. I mean, I, I will say this, though. They're all in fabulous shape. At least the jackets are. Assuming the records are. Yeah. Danny says, Goodwill. Danny's... Danny's got high hopes for inside. She's like, he's probably keeping a good record for inside. Jackie Gleason. I mean, he sleeved all these. Oh, there's my man. I was just talking about this today. Engelbert Humperdinck. Mm -hmm. There he is. What is that? Liberace? Frank Sinatra. Roy Clark. Sammy K. Exotic Percussion. Anyone that takes this time to sleeve all the crappy records, you think would really take the time to sleep the good ones. Bobby Hackett. Jeff Gleason. Burt Bacharach. Bacharach. I'm giving up. Danny's giving up, y'all. 
Artie Shaw, Percy Faith. Where's the good stuff? Beautiful shape though, guys. My God. If we had the room to make like a big a band orchestra a, a crap section, yeah. according to Danny, we could really we could really do we could really do some damage. Here's some of that King Cole. Oh no, that's my man. You're yeah. gonna trigger a lot of people, don't you don't be calling that King Cole? No, I love him. That old typewriter. Oh, He's in beautiful shape. Two LP set. Typewriter in front of you? Oh, yeah, router. Or no, that's router table. No. Oh, right here. Right here, yeah. Okay. Anybody that takes this much time to sleep all the good, the crap stuff, where's the good stuff? When we say crap, guys, we don't mean the music's crap. We just mean the monetary value of the record is low. <laughs> just to clarify. When we say low, we say a couple bucks, you know, if we're lucky. Look. Or donate. Oh, old mag magazines. I might, I might Whole be down. With, I might be down with those. Whole box of them. I might be down with those. Military. This guy was in the military. What you're seeing first, but we are in the box. Right. This might be the meh stuff. The meh stuff. So far, that's what it's looking like. Meh. Yeah, yeah that's a good one, actually. Yeah. That's a great one. I love that. I love that cover. I know. It's I iconic. do too. It's so great. Um, so that's a good sign. You might, you might find Les some better McCann stuff in there. And Eddie Harris. Nice. Okay, so we're starting to see some stuff. Oh, air supply. <laughs> There's some Count Basie. I was pulled out of this box here. There you go. Sinatra. This is probably a whole box of Sinatra. West Montgomery, California, dreaming. Oh, look at that. Somebody was just asking about this. Saturday Fever, we got one. Possibly. I know we got some of the shop for sure. I have more. This looks really cool. This looks cool. Look. Look. What is that? That looks cool. Yeah, Charles Erland. Nice. What label is that on? Prestige, nice. Prestige, worldwide, okay, wide, look wide. This. this looks like a good piece. That looks good. Yeah, what's that? I don't know what that is. Come on, on home. That's a blue note for one, Danny. Yeah. Oh. Uh, one of the seventies ones. Yeah. Cool. Oh my God. What you got? Oh, Roberta Flack. And. Donny Hathaway. Why are you getting excited about this cheap record? Because I love Donny Hathaway. It don't take much to get her excited, y'all. Wow. Hathaway. Wow. I love Donny Hathaway. Is he mine? He, his voice. Maybe. All right, Danny's starting to find some stuff. Ramsey Lewis. Few and far between. Yep. Yeah, it is. It's a six eye. Nice. Pretty good shape, too. All right, that's a good sign, y'all. This does not have Michael's name on it, by the way. It just says Quincy Jones. Oh, nice. That's, uh, what is that, the first press? Uh huh. Doesn't say co produced? Nope. Cool. All right, we're starting to find a couple things, y'all. Um, you know, I mean, we're not getting crazy excited here. It still could be stuff They're that we might not be able to use for the most part. However, there's Jimmy Smith. Nice. Yep. Um, what this tells me is is that no one else has been here because they would have walked away with this. Hello, Basie. Nice. So that gives us that gives us some hope, y'all. Buddy Holly here. It's actually in pretty nice shape. Fifth dimension. Yeah. Cool. Ooh. What you got? What you find? Oh, Nancy. Nancy Sinatra, looking <laughs> scandalous. Cool. The old James Bond soundtracks. Or Sinatra. Oh, this box has mold all in it. You want me to put these back in here? I don't know. It's got mold in it. It does. That's why I left them out. Yeah, that don't sound good. Mold.
Not cheap stuff so far, guys, but there's a couple decent ones already. This Star Trek's cool. I usually sell a Star Trek pretty often. We will, just, I'm getting there. Two more hours to look, y'all. Gotta leave that one. And see if we can find anything a little more worthwhile. Let's see. Yeah, yeah, we're going inside to take a look. <laughs> oh, man. This plate, I haven't really seen it that much. Yeah. Certainly, it's a $100 plate. Okay. Back right bedroom. Back right bedroom. Thank you, sir. Appreciate it. Yep. Okay. One of the things that's in the garage. Believe me, I hate it. I understand. Yeah, this one. Got one here. So much chance for. That's pretty cool. Flying Ross. Ross that. Did you get that guy Lombardo? Burt Camfort. Pretty much the same that's out in the garage in here. That yeah. makes it tough, man. Yeah. That makes it tough. I don't think this is for us. It's probably not going to be for us once we can buy just some of it. Yeah. That's, that's the thing, yeah. Mm -hmm. Very common. Kind of, I'm sure, yeah. Which is so true. Goldfinger soundtrack. Tons of Harry James and Boots Randolph and stuff that I usually turn away. These are a lot of records to not have much good stuff. Let me get over here and flip through these if I can. I looked through a majority of that box there. Okay. It's a lot of like, There's some cool like James Bond stuff. I mean, that's cool. Neat pottery. I don't, I'm don't. i not a pottery guy. But no. Personally, here's the pottery person. Do you see any records? Look around in all the little crannies. Yeah. Like there's a books, like books. Memorabilia. Yeah. Because this guy apparently was in the military. There's like a like, look like Civil War buttons right there. We're sitting here looking for records. There's probably a bunch, of, mo there's probably a bunch of money right there. <laughs> Tons of beer steins. Tons of beer steins. This is an antique picker's dream for sure. God, look at all these books. I know. Look at the ones about the German look army. Look at all there. these books. Put the swastikas on there. Yeah. Oh. Craziness. So them books are probably pretty valuable. All right. Let's let this be a whole box of fire. That'd be awesome. Hold that. Just hold that white if you don't mind. Art Mooney. More James Bond. He was obsessed with James Bond. Herb Alpert. Lots jazz, but not the kind of jazz we want. Nor does anyone else want, really. All the good stuff. All the good stuff. Mm -hmm. like Jimmy Smith. Coltrane. John Coltrane. Miles Davis. Even like Ferris Dizzy, Sanders. Dizzy Gillespie. There's like none of that. All the James Bond here. This is all James Bond. This is, he's got like a soundtrack for like every James Bond. It's like he bought everything but like the wrong everything. Well, maybe yeah. not to him the wrong everything. Right, but. yeah, like all the Dean Martin you could want here. Right. El Martino. Engelbert Humperdinck. A lot of fun in the Patsy Klein, we could sell her. She's from Winchester. But. No rock that I've seen at all. No Elvis. No Jerry Lee. No Rockabilly. Mm -mm. No 
know Metallica's. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no heavy metal, obviously. No Lots of Linda way. Ronstadt, though. Every Linda Ronstadt you can imagine up in here. We're seeing uh, Bert Kampfert. Lots of it. Uh, Peggy Lee, lots of it. Linda Ronstadt, lots of it. Basement now, trying to Dean Martin. find better stuff here. Dean Martin. Tony Bennett, Dean Martin. Here. Bert. Put these back yeah, in This is lots of it. Oh boy. Peter Nero. Okay, he's got the list. <clears throat> he's got all the artists right here on top of the box. Cool. That's what we're dealing with, y'all. Just not the right stuff. Mm -hmm. Not the right stuff. Jars, pottery, all kinds of great stuff. Oh, you know that's why I haunted. You might have to take that with you. See, like we didn't find much today, but we found this creepy baby doll. I found a baby doll haunted by the spirit of a seven-year-old girl named Judy. <laughs> she loves Christmas lights, cats, <laughs> and playing patty cake. She asked that you leave out milk and cookies for her every night. Mm. It's a microwave. You need a microwave? No, oh, God. I don't okay. think that looked good sitting in our kitchen. <laughs> hey, it's got weird vibes. She's feeling weird energy down here. Okay. At least I'm having fun, though. You having fun? Could be worse. What's in here? That looks like an old sewing machine. See that? It's pretty cool. I'm my friend. <laughs> Appreciate you letting us look, though. Um, it, it happens. I mean, you guys bought this place just with everything in it, huh? She was. There's a lot of great stuff down there. Like I'm not an well, antique I'm doing dealer, a, I'm but doing a clean out. I'm, I, have, I have an auction company in Cumberland. Uh, okay. Okay. I'm doing, okay. I'm doing a clean out. I have seven weeks left to clean this place out. Wow. I wish you have seen it before we got in. I mean, you, could this, you like this not looks even? Good. Wow. Could you like not even like walk in here? I guess in the time. Wow. That's crazy. Yeah. I guess I mean you could take all them to auction. I guess I'm assuming right, or they just don't do well. Or... There's, there, there's no sense in. Okay. Yeah. Them. That's yeah. That's the problem really. Um, like I have staff, I mean, we can move out of big stuff, but it's like, I don't think it's gonna be worth the effort, man. That's the only okay. problem. Like I, I kept telling so her this. be free if you want yeah, them. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Like, yeah, like even, I was even telling her, I was like, even if they were free, it's tough to take them all. <laughs> Cause I just ain't seeing much. Right. I don't know if, um, you know, I don't know, he just probably didn't buy the right stuff, I guess. That's all I can think of, man. Um, well, if he was 95, you know. he was in a different era <clears throat> right. of music that's relevant right. now. I mean, I could go through and probably piece together like a couple crates of stuff. But then again, you're still just left with just all this stuff. Right. You know what I mean? Right. And it, it's like uh, I bought thousands of records many times, but like at least they'll be like, I can at least use like a third of it or something or like half of it or 60% of it. And then the rest of it I end up donating or putting out at a dollar a piece or something. Um, that's what a lot of these records would be, would be dollar a piece, try to do that, and then donate them as a tax deduction later in the year. <laughs> that's what we end up doing. The Goodwill hates seeing me every time I roll up there. I'm <laughs> <laughs> records, 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 and it's, it's that's the tough stuff, man. That big band orchestra polka, man, it's just hard to right. do anything well, with, man. It. Hard to do it. anything with, but if this was all the right stuff, oh my God, you could have a fortune here, right. you yeah. know? Um, so. look through it, I've, I've been so busy trying to get this place cleaned up. Right, so. yeah. right. 
But I mean, I'm not an antique dealer, but I'm sure that this, so a lot oh, yeah. of this, this stuff's this probably mid, great. This mid-century stuff is, yeah. Yeah, that's probably have great. Have company coming Wednesday. Okay. Wednesday, yeah, so. yeah, I mean, you guys are probably going to kill it on that mm-hmm. stuff. Hopefully. But, um, Hopefully. I, I know records. That's, that's what I know. Room, like the old books. Right. Military yeah. stuff. Yeah, military yeah German, absolutely. Yeah. A couple in there. I might, might snag that I laid out because I was like, well, maybe. <laughs> No, hey, if you can go grab that, that'd be great. I thought it was over here on that side, yeah. but I can't. Or I might have walked it. Maybe I walked it to the front up here and laid it down. I can't remember. So we're obviously not going to buy them all, but he said we could buy what we want. And after what? What do you think? How long we've we been looking for this Miles Davis record? Forty-five minutes, probably. Have you? Do you know any, any idea where that's at? No. I okay, can't. because I'm going to tell you right now. Here it is. Well, shit, that's the Michael Jackson that we were looking for. <laughs> There's the Buddy Holly. There's the Mouse Davis. You stuck them in a box. Oh, my God. You stuck them in a box. So we've been looking for these records for like 45 minutes. You stuck them in a box. That's I did. Exactly I do. take the blame for it all. Yep. Here you go. Put this in our little pile. Ugh. Gee whiz. Gosh. What, what a day. The put, stress. Put that in our pile. Thank you, love. Uh-huh. Thank you, thank you. Thanks for being patient with me. We're out here. We're in the dark now, y'all. Just trying to find something to make the gas money worthwhile coming down here today. Flight mode, guys. Trying to take a look at everything we can here in the next 10 minutes. See if I'm not leaving too many great things behind. Phew, I am back here catwalking, y'all. Trying not to step on vinyl, standing on the rails. This is reminding me I'm at 20,000 record haul if you guys ain't seen that video make sure to uh click on that one i had to walk in i had to walk on records on that dig it was a good one i think i could use okay so i was gonna give you 100 bucks for that stuff right. if that if that's okay with you yeah that's great okay um it was tough <laughs> it's tough to find find anything half decent in there but um we're back we survived we came, we conquered, we saw the records. I don't know if we conquered. Uh, we conquered Somewhat. We conquered three crates of records. Three crates of records. This, this guy literally bought everything of everything. It was just everything of the wrong type of stuff. Yeah, there's one Miles Davis we found. One, um, yeah. I found a Star Wars original soundtrack score. He loved uh, his um, his James Bond soundtracks yeah, too. Yeah, we, we grabbed a bunch of those and we grabbed the Top yep. Gun soundtrack. Um, there's a Michael Jackson thriller, which was yeah, there's a thriller super there. out of place. Um, so a couple decent jazz, you know, a little bit of a little bit of the good jazz stuff, but not a lot. Um, you know, he had a bunch of stuff like Sammy K and uh, Perry Combo and yeah. Herb Alpert. Oh, tons of Herb Alpert. You guys Alpert. saw the video. Like it's just tons of that stuff that Tony you know, Matola. It, and... Well, and I'm sure someone's gonna say, why didn't you guys get that stuff? I love that stuff. Well, the thing is, we already got tons of that stuff. And we got it in our bargain bin for a dollar to a piece. And there's we, too much there's of it for us, and it. not yeah. enough of you that you that buy it. That's right, and it's it's not very. Uh, it doesn't make much sense for us to pack and ship a two dollar record away. So right. any of our records that are five dollars and under, we usually throw in a bargain bin. Yep. And people come in and buy them occasionally, but we have we have a bargain bin problem really. We got yeah ten thousand bargain bin we records too many. in our back of our store. <laughs> I don't need 10,000 yeah. more, unfortunately. Right. But Too let us know what we missed. Yep. Yeah. Let us know what we missed and uh, appreciate you guys uh, riding along with us today. Hope you guys had fun. Yep. Until next time. Bye.